Oh, so <laughs> Hi there, um, I'm about to cast Charlie here and I'm going to be working with Alginet on his face um, because he wants to have a plaster cast of his head. So I'm going to do an Alginet underneath on the front and back of his head and then cover it with uh, the plaster impregnated bandage that I usually use. And I'm Got some gloves on because Elton is very sticky and I need it. I've done this just now. Over there, isn't it? Somewhere. Okay. <coughs> okay, for his face, I'm using this one. I got it from Taranti and it's a slow setting one, but even though it says it's slow setting, it still only gives me working time of three to four minutes, which isn't a lot. Oh. 
Okay, yeah, did you turn it off? Oh no. It's just that sometimes it's, uh, I think it's got an automatic shutdown. No, right. trying to stretch it out a bit to get it level, but what's happening is it keeps sticking into my collateral You okay? Mm. Good. Mm. David Bailey over the car. <laughs> 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 oh, I see, no, I know, but I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Greg, just give up. Don't talk about it. We don't want him to laugh. It says flat off and then it's such a thing. Shut up now. Because you're going to make him laugh and then he's going to strike up. Can you breathe okay? Mm. Mm. Okay, okay. <laughs> it's weird the way it slowly slides down. <laughs> <laughs> you know, careful you don't make him laugh. Mm. <laughs> Hello? I'm casting Charlie! I think I'm just going to have to keep an eye on this and watch it till it goes off before I do the other bit because I'm worried about it um, and your nose getting covered if I'm watching. Hi, I'm doing a, a cast. Right. Trying to get that bit under your nose. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. You still okay? It's got the golf now. Well, it doesn't feel like it has, but it will, will go off. It says it's got sort of um, a working time of four minutes, and then it was a setting time of uh, eight, I think. So it's got a while to go yet. But I actually put in more water than it said on the instructions because it was so solid we wouldn't be able to put it in so I probably slowed it down as well. Hi Danny. Right, Graham, keep a close yeah. eye on his nose for yeah. me. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Doesn't seem to be moving now, does it? No. Yeah. Thank you. It's a good sign. Right, but I don't want him to get stuck in there longer than is necessary. So.
Oh, put them on the button is what works. Peel off your uh, implements and things, off Sure, Daddy. Does it just peel off your bowls and things? I mean, you know, yeah. Wash them up, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's really good stuff, Algernon. it yeah. because it's um, it's biodegradable. It just sort of breaks down anyway. So. It's What happens when it breaks down then? It, it, it shrinks, uh, dries out. Uh. So I'm just trying to get it to move because it's a lot thicker than the other one. I'm just trying to get it to move up so that it comes up towards the join without actually joining on. So I've got a slight gap in between the two. It actually works well having them slight different materials because this one is a totally different colour. I can actually see quite easily where one starts and the other one ends. Why do you want a gap? Them? Because it's easier to get him out. Oh, I mean, right. you yeah. can 
make it as one solid block and then cut him out afterwards. But I actually think mentally to be in two halves is a much happier place to be than to be in something that traps your head in a solid, you know, in one. And, um, but when you do the cast, will they come out the gap? Um, well, no, because uh, there'll be plaster bandage through, uh, covering over oh, the gap right, on the outside. Oh, right, yeah, of course. Yeah. So there will be a slight, I mean, there will be a slight bit in that, um... alternates for most of my um, when well, I do my head and body cast because I don't actually want them to look too realistic. Yeah, because you, you do your sculpture on the top of it, yeah. yeah. It's, no, it's, it's basically because I, I want to get the basic shape of somebody yeah. without it looking exactly like them because I, I actually find that if it looks too too detailed and too real, it's really hard to cut into it, you know, oh. it's like a mental, oh, right, it's, yeah. it's just really hard to, and you find that you it, you alter your design, or I alter my design, yeah. because I want to keep all the beautiful qualities of the, the person's face, yeah. rather than doing what I'm trying, or supposedly trying to do, which is to produce, you know, produce it as a shell, it begins, it then becomes to be them, rather than just sort of like mm. their armour. Yeah. That's the nastiest part's over now. Okay, 
it's already impregnated, that band. Yeah. 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 It's the stuff that um, they used to use to set off. Yeah. They don't do more. Yeah. No, they, they've, they've got um, fun juice that's impregnated with resin now. Oh, right, yeah. It's a lot stronger. Yeah, yeah. yeah. it doesn't need to be heavy or thick. <laughs> Okay, I'll try and do this as quickly as I can, shall I? Okay, first bit I'm going to do is cross your nose. I'll do just some detailed bits first and then later I'll whack a whole load of this stuff on quite thick so I can get it on fast. Because I'm not worried about trying to get the detail of your face on this, it doesn't have to be that neatly done.
Parents were very interested in having a look at the uh, the hippies who were sunbathing naked on the beaches. beaches so, yeah, so we went over the side. <laughs> Yeah, there were thousands of people. It was ridiculous. Yeah. There must have been four or five thousand uh, naked yeah. people on the beach, and then another couple of thousand along lining along the cliffs. And uh, all the um, fleet from cows came round, and <laughs> we're all watching people. I'm not surprised. <laughs> it really was young and beautiful. Yeah. The Yellow White Festival started again in the last few years. It's yeah, yeah. really good. I know that one was a disaster area <laughs> because they, they declared it a disaster area off the second day. Yeah. The island ran out of food. I went to Freshwater, which was the nearest village at the time. I don't think and the there was any idea of how big it was going to no, be. No, there wasn't a single... Have you ever seen a supermarket like it? It's a, you know, kind of ordinary size village supermarket or thing. Yeah. Not anything edible. There was nothing on the shelves except for bathroom detergents and things. Anything edible, even toothpaste. <laughs> and, and the pubs all ran out of beer and they got in more. And, and it was on. Once I've finished this bit, I'll have to leave the back on for a few minutes just to harden up, but I'll be able to take the front off. You okay? Mm -hmm. Good. Thank you. you are so patient. <laughs> I'm so impressed with you. So the last time we tried to do it, it, uh, it was there for hours. <laughs> okay. I miss this is taking longer than I'd usually take if I was to a client. Mm. And I don't, as I said, I don't usually use the alternates because I, I, mm. I don't like the detail, but to be honest, I think it's also mm. a, a form of semi torture doing this to somebody. <laughs> and, uh, oh. I don't mind torturing Charlie. <laughs> <laughs> we did volunteers. <laughs> I think I'm going to get a reputation for doing horrible things to young men because I, I had um, on my YouTube, there's a YouTube I was, I was showing at a gallery in London and in the gallery next door that belonged to the same gallery owner, they were um, filming for the front cover of a, a magazine, for a banker's magazine mm. and they had this young guy, very handsome young guy who was a banker, who they needed splattered with paint and they couldn't work out how to do it and and I just showed, went in and chucked some pot to him for them. Yeah. So um, yeah. it was brilliant. He was poor yeah. son was lying there. <laughs> sorry, poor, mm, sorry, rude word. Yeah. I was lying there and I just like, splattered him all over. <laughs> right. I'm going to try and take off the front plaster bit first. Okay. Well, you take it off the while. Oh, I've just thought it's attached to the. Um, I might take the rubber off as well because I forgot we've got the cotton wool mm -hmm. trying to attach it. So. Mm -hmm. okay. You might find if you can wiggle your face slightly, it's attached very nicely to your shirt. Okay, it's alright, it's just coming down and looped into it. Okay, how are you doing? Mm -hmm. You're doing well, I think we're getting there. Right, don't pull back yet. I need to just yeah, it at the top. Right, okay. I think it's got enough uh, yeah, no? 
Oh. Oh, you got the right, man. <laughs> All right. Wow. Okay, that's weird. So I just showed. That's quite creepy, isn't it? I'm going to say goodbye because uh, you'll probably be bored to see the rest of it. Oh. Well, maybe you won't actually. Wait a second. Sorry. Right. Oh, it's just and quite then, relaxing, the first bit. And then, uh, and then, it and then Dad starts making me laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Talking about naked people. Okay. Right. Oh, I think I've got your hat as well. Yeah, the hat seems to be a great. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh. That's okay. So that's the black one. Yeah. Like this. Oh, yeah, because the blue stuff I've seen before, um, that's why I said when I was doing it, it's up the white stuff. I think that's the most silent I've ever been. <laughs> yeah. Forced to be silent. Yeah. Actually, that, that's a bit fragile stuff. Yeah. Could you grab that from outside? I'm just going to put this down and let it set a bit because it's still a bit on the soft side. <coughs> okay, and then what I'll do is I'll put it together and put the plaster and I can do a YouTube for that. Okay, bye bye! <laughs>